Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Simple Kiamu Fogeng and if you are new in this channel, thank you very much for clicking on this video. Please don't forget to like the video, comment down below and subscribe. If you are a returning subscriber, a regular, regular, a family member, thank you very much for yet clicking on this video. You know the rule by now, please don't forget to like the video and comment down below. So guys, in today's video, I'm going to unpack in details how many items I buy with my son's child support grant. So, my child receive child support grant each and every month it is a 480 which is not enough money to buy all the baby stuff we appreciate it but it is not enough money i know that there are moms who are living out of only child support grant in south africa and it is said the child support grant is given to a child whom their parents are not working or they are working and their payment doesn't meet the threshold. There is a threshold whereby if your income per annum doesn't meet that threshold, your child is going to receive child support grant. I pray that God may listen to our prayers to find a job and a very decent job so that we can be able to support ourselves, our families and our children. They deserve better. This gift of God deserves better. And to be honest with you, a child is so expensive. Child support grant is not enough. That's an honest truth. So guys, this video is inspired by someone who asked me in the comment section if my son received child support grant and how do I manage to buy all the stuff that baby needs with his child support grant. So to be quite honest with you, my child doesn't only depend on child support grant. His dad is helping us a lot. I don't want to lie. That man helps us a lot because he sent enough money to sustain me as well as my son. So it is the enough money. I don't want to lie. But the focus of today's video is to unpack only how many items I buy with my child support grant. So without wasting any time, let's get right into the video. So guys, as I mentioned earlier, child support grant in South Africa, it is 480 per child each and every month. Like I said, it is a little money. It is not enough to buy all the necessary things that a baby needs a month. But we appreciate it. As I've said, we appreciate it and we are not complaining because we are not working. We are unemployed. Others are working, but the payment is not enough. So we appreciate it. So guys, I have made a budget in this booklet of mine where I wrote all the things that I buy with the child support grant. So guys, before I get into the budget, what is happening is that normally we receive child support grant around the 4th or the 5th of each and every month. Then what is happening is that my boyfriend send money after the 15th of each and every month because he get paid at the 15th. So it will depend when he send money but it is after the 15th of each and every month so guys let's get into it what i buy first and foremost the important stuff the important first nappies so what happened is that my son used two packs of haggis which are 66 inside so at the beginning of the month with his child support grant i buy only one pack of 66 nappies so normally it costs 200 so from 480 we minus 200 the other thing that I buy, it is the wipes. So I buy a pack of three cuddle some wipes. They cost 55 francs at pep. So nappies out. The other thing that I buy, it is Amasi. So as I've said in my past video that I have introduced Amasi to my son's meal and he enjoys it. He loves it if I can say. So normally he consumes four liters of Amasi milk a month. But I buy only two liter at the beginning of the month. Then I will top up when my boyfriend send the money. So I buy Amasi two liter which cost 30 rand. The other things that I buy are purities. So all in all purities that I buy a month are 10 or 12 it will depend of how much i have at that particular month so i buy five purities at the beginning of the month with his child support grant which costs 60 rand but for purities guys i'm going to stop buying them maybe next day i will stop buying them completely because this guy has outgrown them like he is old enough for purities guys let's not lie but for now we are still buying them and at the beginning of the month i buy five which costs 60 rand the other thing that I buy, like I said on my past video, that I have introduced oats. So normally I buy two boxes of oats because there are eight sachets in each and every box. So at the beginning of the month, with his child support grant, I buy only one pack, which cost 50 rand. The other thing that I buy, it is the wheat bigs. 
so he loves them now he loves them i know in my past video i've said like there is a complication with like fresh milk but now he enjoys them so we buy with Bix one pack which cost 40 rand. So the other thing that we buy it is Mabele. So by now you know like my son loves Mabele and he enjoys it a lot. So he consumed two packs of Mabele. But at the beginning of the month I buy only one pack which cost 30 rand. And the remaining amount will be 50 rand or 40 rand. It will depend on how much they cost at that particular month. Then the remaining amount will be for snacks. So for snacks, I normally buy popcorn, zimbas, and biscuit at the beginning of the month. Then I will top up everything that is left when my boyfriend sent money. So guys, for cosmetics, normally cosmetics last us. I don't want to lie. Cosmetics last. The only thing that I need to buy, like more often it is the soap because we finish it very fast but other things like vaginina epimex and other stuff we buy them during the middle of the month when my boyfriend sends money so yeah guys so at that middle of the month when my boyfriend sends money we top up everything that is left like i said i buy only one pack at the beginning of the month then when he sends money we buy another pack and again we add on my belly on oats and we add on amas like i said he consumed four liter and at the beginning of the month we only buy two liter so we add on amasi we add on more snacks and drinks like i said i have introduced like drinks on my son's meal so we add those drinks then we add fruits so i have introduced some fruits like strawberries pears bananas and watermelon sometimes and pineapple so yeah guys those are the things that i managed to buy with my child sasa grant at the beginning of the month i pray each and every day that at least god give me a decent job a job that is going to enable us to take care of ourselves our families and our children so i really pray so hard that i get a job so that i can be able to assist my boyfriend he has been doing a lot of things alone and i can see that it is tough on his side even though he may not say it but i can see that it is tough so i pray that i may be able to assist him there and there so that we can be able to enjoy our love go on vacations do some trips and all the things that lovers do so yeah guys we came at the end of the video i hope you enjoyed the video please don't forget to like the video comment down below and subscribe i love you guys and i love you so much bye